it's a game you, you want to win. It's like going into a, a club level. It's like going into a local derby. Um, I still one of the best games um, I played with in, for England was Scotland away. I scored two goals. One of them wasn't um, too bad either, was it? Yeah, so it's... <laughs> um, there's a hatred, I think, everyone knows that, between England and Scotland through football. And there's no better feeling when you beat them. Will we win Friday? Yeah, I think so. I think today's game was, was a big game. Um, I'd, I'd like to see him go with two strikers um, on Friday because I think Scotland will sit back. Who would you um, play? What two? I'd go with Harry Kane and Calvert-Lewin and use them both as a, as a physical presence up Big top. Shot, yeah. um, get the ball out wide, get cross in the box. Um, I think that'll be a, a, a way of breaking them down. You mentioned your two goals against Scotland there. What would you say is your, your favourite England goal, favourite memory that meant most to you? Was it the Scotland goal? Favourite Scotland goals up there. Um, I scored, I think it was 18, 17, 18 against Argentina um, in a friendly, friendly match, which um, I loved because I just wanted to score against Argentina. Um, I'd probably, I'd probably say the my goal against Croatia um, in the Euro, Euro 2004. Yeah, I played the one-two with Michael Owen and ran through. And for fans. When you go through 1v1 with the goalkeeper, you think it's easy. It's very difficult because there's all kinds going through your mind. Um, yeah. What's the keeper going to do? Where are you going to go? Are you going to wait for the keeper to move? Um, so just the link-up play and then the finish, um, that was my best goal, thing. The fans <laughs> still love you, Wayne. They still love you. <laughs> Does that still feel good? Yeah, listen, I think for the fans, um, I think what fans appreciate is players who, who work hard and um, who, who give what they expect and I've, that's one thing I've always done is worked hard. I think fans appreciate them. I love how you can concentrate whilst listening to that still completely because you're used to just playing it and concentrating when you hear that and it's like, I'm hearing that, that's all I'm hearing right now, uh, but uh, that must feel good. Um, <laughs> what's the team we've got to watch out for? I think there's a few. I think France is, it will be a, a very difficult game to, to play if we, if we come up against them. They've obviously won the World Cup. Um, they're a very good team. Portugal, I think, will will have a good tournament. Um, Ronnie, Ronaldo, your old mate, do you think he'll have a good tournament? Yeah, I think so. He always does, doesn't he? Um, if he gets the golden boot, does that make him the best ever, do you think? If he'd be up there, of course, yeah. Um, Lukaku is in unbelievable form. Um, Mbappe... Um, I think he'll do really well. Um, Harry Kane. Um, so all the goal scorers, really, we all expect. I'm sure they'll all be fighting for that, for that golden boot. Um, hopefully, it's Harry Kane. Um, if if he gets it, it means England will 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 have done well. So, um, but I think out of them three, um, really. But overall, you've got high hopes for us this tournament. It yeah. could come home, Wayne. Yeah, I hope this so. Could mate. Be I the hope year. so. <laughs>